something fun. fun. Something we said fun. we said something fun. All right. So here we are reviewing for our topic for TEST, which stands for test. All right. Unfortunately, I don't think I have time for people to walk up and present their problems. But I'm going to have to do to go through it, make sure we have time, and then when you're at home, you can pause it, you can go slow motion, you can rewind it, and you can make sure you know exactly how to do it. Right, peoples? Yeah! Yeah! So here we go. Okay. Mrs. Jones sells houses. She earns a 5% commission. Now, commission means they're going to pay her a certain percentage. So all we need to do is find out 5% of this number. All right? 500, so 500,000. Yeah. I think that's 500,000. Yeah. Times, what do I type in? 3.5. Point. Zero five. So twenty five thousand. Now, I guess you guys have that super secret percent button, so you guys can test it for me. If you type in five hundred thousand times five and then push the percent button, it might work. Yeah, it works. So you got that secret button on your calculator, but you do need to know how to do it. So the answer is. $25,000. Now, when you're on commission, you might want to write yourself a note. You're not adding that to this, right? They're asking how much money would Mrs. Jones, the real estate person, make? They're not going to add $500,000 and give Mrs. Jones $500,000. Okay? So write a note, B. Write something down on number one that says commission, do not add to the, to the original number. On number one, do not add to the original, okay? Number two, last year Mark brought a surfboard, okay? There's our first number. His bike's value has decreased. Uh-oh. Decrease means it's going to go up or down? Down. Down. So I'm going to put, I'm going to put a big down arrow. Mark's kind of a downer. <laughs> so not funny. Okay, so it is now worth three hundred. How much did it decrease, by the way? How, no, how much? Fifty bucks, right? Okay, so we subtract. Listen, please. So. So if we if if it decreased fifty bucks, we need to find out what percent that is. So what percent is fifty out of three fifty from the original? I don't know. Well, I'm going to divide it. That's how you do this problem. Watch fifty divided by three fifty. No, it's one divided by it's it's it could be reduced to one seventh. But one seventh is point one four. Okay, point one four is fourteen percent. Okay, so fourteen percent decrease because the price went down. How much? Fifty bucks. So that was fourteen percent. All right, zero. All right. So moving on, something fun. Okay, three. Caitlin deposits six seventy five. So we've got a number there. And we've got interest, which we just learned about. That's what we did for homework. Who wants to try this problem? Me. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, do you have a code name, sir? Uh, cup of Noodles. Cup of Noodles. All right, let's give a hand to Cup of Noodles. Okay, Cup of Noodles. So, so how do we do this, sir? So, oh, so you, by the way, she said, sorry. It was 3% and for 5 years. So you do 675 mm -hmm. times 0 0.03 to get 3% of that number. Okay, hold on. 675 times, you don't have to put a 0, but 0 0.03. It does have to be 
0.03. Okay, equals, okay, so what did that tell us, by the way, so far? So that's the percent of 675, and then you multiply that right, by 5. Right, that's the percentage, but how many years is that? One. That's one year, so then you have to multiply by 5 to get 5 years. Excellent. Okay, so we take this, we go times, whoa, that was weird. Let me see if I can make this happen. There we go. Times five. $101.25. Oh, Good job, models. <laughs> Good job, Good job cup of noodles. Okay. Excellent job. All right. How many people, raise your hand, could have done that also? Yay. Almost everybody. Okay. Which items below... Uh, did we round? I don't know if we had to. Let's see. That's a good question. Oops. Where was the rounding? No, because 675, 3% was, we didn't have to round because it was exactly 25 cents. All right. I know, but I changed my mind. Okay. So which items can she buy? Yes, Jeffrey? Yeah, she can buy that something that's forty-three. Uh huh. Uh, right, but she can't buy the, any of those guys, oh, right? So X through uh -huh. that, X through that, and X through that. Oh, Hugs and kisses. Good job, Jeffrey, sir. Appreciate it's that. Good. Okay. The sales tax. In Connecticut, is five percent. Lucky them. What's the sales tax in most parts of Los Angeles County? You guys are so smart. Daniel wants to buy a suit that costs seventy bucks. How much will Daniel need to buy the suit, including the tax? All right. Should I let him do it? Okay, what's your code name? Your code name is Robin. Okay, Robin and Batman is coming by. No, Robin. Robin Hood. Oh, Robin. Top Robin. Okay, Red Robin. Okay, so how do we do this problem, sir? So. We're going to turn 5% mm -hmm. into 0 0.05. Okay, so 0 0.05. Then we're going to multiply it by 70. Okay, so okay. times 70 yeah. equals $3.50. Okay, and then, we, that's our, then we're done. That's our tax. Oh, then right. we're done. Then we then we do 70. What do you mean, then we? What, aren't we done? Then we done? do 70 plus 3.50, and then we... I was trying to trick him. He didn't let me trick him. That's how much money you need. Because you're so smart. Okay, so $70 plus the 350 is going to be including tax, 7350 yeah. Let's give Raman a big round of applause. Okay, a sweater is on sale, so that's a discount. Let me erase this, these markings here. It's on sale for 35% off. You guys got so good at this, especially with Kahoot, didn't you? Yeah. Okay, so we got 35% off of 25 bucks, and we want the new price. All right, so you want to tell us the quick way to do it? I want the quick way for the YouTube. Okay. Do you have a code name? No one? No one from nowhere. All right. Tell us how we can do it, please. So you turn 35% into 0.35. Okay. But that's not the quickest way. The quickest way was uh, take 100 first, remember? Yeah. What was it, guys? Okay, so go ahead. So we're going to take 100 minus, minus 35. Good, because we're going to find out. We're going to multiply by the final price already, or the final percentage already. So that's what, everybody? 65%. Okay, so then we got to go. 
Point sixty five because we moved the decimal over twice times twenty five dollars. Twenty five bucks. And it's sixteen point twenty five dollars. Excellent. Let's give our nobody from nowhere a hand, please. We subtracted to get sixty five percent and then we multiply. So sixteen point twenty I like my sweater. Oh, oh, you're talking about the problem. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Okay, we're going to turn the page around. How loudly can you guys do it? Okay. Oh my God. Okay. Number seven. Number seven. All right, that's enough. Your total bill for dinner at Toppers is 75 bucks. You want to leave a 20% tip. All right. Now, they're asking for just the amount of the tip. They're not asking for the whole bill. Does anybody want to try it? Okay. Do you have a code name, sir? Okay, I don't know. I don't know who's going to do the problem. How do you do this, sir? Right, so how do we make 20 into a decimal? Move the decimal how many places? Two, twice, so one, two. So it's going to be now. Point 20, good. Now, he didn't get tricked because we've been doing a lot of 2%. If it was 2%, it'd be 0 0.02. But since it's 20%, it's 0 0.2. Good. So 20, so we're going to go 0 0.2 times. 75. Okay. Do we agree? Yeah. Good. 0 0.2 times 75. 15 bucks. Excellent job, Mr. IDK. That's the answer because we're not getting the total that they're paying. We're only they're only asking for the tip. Just the tip amount. Yes. Maybe maybe a P quick. Okay. You want to sell lollipops to make money for a field trip. You decide to mark up the lollipop 75%. So they started out at 0.25. We need to mark them up. Well, first we need to find 75%. So 0 0.25, 0 0.25 times, what do you guys think? 0.75 equals. Okay, now we need to round up here. 0.19. That means each one is going to be increased by 19, per, 19 cents. We did that. We multiplied times 75 cents. I mean, 75 percent, excuse me. And that gave us 19 cents. Okay? So each one increases by 19 cents, so that gives us uh, 54 cents. 54 cents. Okay? How much will each one sell for 54 cents? Okay, now this is interest earned. So we did that a bunch last night for homework. So let's see, 500 times 2%. Let's do one really quickly. 500 times 0 0.02 equals, and we do that times how many years? Four. Four. Oh, that's easy. 10, 10 times 4 is 40. Okay. And now we get...